So we have figured out the amount that this person needs to have in the account in order to withdraw $6,000 a month in retirement. And that's the present value of ordinary annuity. Next, our next step is going to be to figure out what they need to do to make that happen. And so this person has 38 years to save, to invest money and watch it grow. And we're going to figure out what the monthly payment they're going to need to make in order to reach their goal is going to be. So we know that we want a total in the account of 841,671.04. We don't know how much they're going to need to save to put away monthly now to make that happen. We're going to assume the interest rate of seven and a half percent. It's going to be monthly and it's going to be for 38 years because they're 24 now. They're going to retire at age 62. So our 0 0.075 over 12 is going to be the same as it was in the previous one, 00625. And MT is going to be 12 times 38, which is going to be three, 456. So in our formula, we're going to have S, oops, I need to put the number in there, 841. Six seventy one oh four is equal to R times one plus point zero zero six two five to the power of four hundred and fifty six minus one over point zero zero six two five. And we can go ahead and swing that in Wolfram. I may have already done that because uh, I've been trying to kind of bounce back and forth with this video a little bit. Yep. So I already put that in Wolfram. I'm at the place where I just need to divide by that number. And again, remember for this, you are using the future value of annuity formula. So what am I dividing by? 2581.62. And we get that this person needs to put away $326.02 a month. Now this seems like a ridiculously small amount, $326 to reach a value of $841,000 in retire when they're ready to retire. And it is. And the reason that it is so small is because they are starting early in life at age 24. Every year that they wait to get started, this value that they need to save, this number would grow like crazy every year that they wait to get started. So time is fertilizer for money. And if you're trying to build wealth for retirement, the key to that is to start when you are as young as possible. So uh, we know that we are gonna need to be putting away 326.02 each month in order for this person to reach their goal. And the, uh, the subsequent questions here, we're gonna answer um, in another video. Uh, I'm going to answer both of these in a third video uh, addressing the stuff on this slide. So we will be taking some of the information from this uh, right here and moving it onto a new page so that we have some room. So I will be back with that information copied over and we will be thinking about, gee, how much did they put in versus how much is it worth and how much is it going to continue to grow? while this person is in retirement because the investment continues to grow during retirement because we take a little bit out and what's left grows. We take a little bit out, what's left grows. So we'll be back with video number three for this slide right away.